guys, this is Maline from Maline Budgets. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Happy Sunday. In today's video, we are going over my rollover money to see how much I spent or didn't spend during the week. But first, we have a little bit of happy mail. And this happy mail came from Anna again because she is adamant. Uh, she wants to help me finish off some of the letterbox uh, trackers because they're really, really rare for us to find those letters in the wild. They're uh, the ones printed first, A through E. And by the way, Anna, this is the way that the envelope came. I'm so sorry, I have no idea what the post office is doing. Like, uh, they had some, uh, also had some bands around the uh, Happy Mail to protect the content, but I hope everything is here and safe. So this is everything she sent me. I will get it out of the packaging so it doesn't make too much noise for Mr. Loki to come and inspect it. So first of all, here she wrote, Box search, I enjoy it. I love hunting for them. My serotonin rush. Here you can see Loki is just after the money. Oh my god. So she sent me A's, B's, a couple of C's, D, and E for my boyfriend. Thank you so, so much, Anna. You already sent me 10 of these last time. Please let me know if you're collecting any or if you're grouping them in some way because um, I know your name starts with A and uh, it's really difficult to find them for you as well. So thank you so, so much. Oh my God, so many things. So she wrote, my dearest Madalina, hello again. I promise you a new surprise, a few letter bucks. I know I shouldn't have. Um, I've bought some nice prints and I thought of you. Cat prints are sent with love for a smile. Birthday prints are very nice and colorful for another smile. Aww. Uh, it says on the back in Romanian just for you. So the note on the back is private. Oh, I appreciate it, Anna. So let's see what she included in this envelope. Oh my God. So she sent me this, uh, this Bitcoin. This is so cool. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. Okay, so she sent me some um, emoji stickers. Maybe I can use them uh, for a savings challenge because I know Tracy has one with uh, some cute emojis. Oh, I love the birthday stickers. You know how I decorate my um, my monthly update page uh, with these stickers, but maybe I can do it into a savings challenge because I have some others. And I love these ones with um, with the alphabet as well. Uh, these are just perfect for summer uh, to indicate the place where we left off on a challenge. Let me see. Okay, these are heart-shaped ones. <laughs> I love this face. This is me most of the time. So many post-it notes and stickers. Oh my god. No way, she made me. Okay, so we have here some trackers. So the date and my to-do list. And these can be like budget trackers. And just look at the print, it's cats. And this one has foxes and raccoons in space. This is just brilliant. I don't know where you found them, Anna, but they're fantastic. Okay, and we have more scrapbooking paper here. Ooh, this one with the hot air balloons. This is so beautiful and the very pretty florals. I love these. I need to create something with them. Thank you so much. And that's not all. So she sent me more of the heart-shaped uh, stickers and then it says for your little nieces. All my best wishes for health and faith. So she sent me these cute little color in challenges from her daughter's book for my nieces and for the nephew. I, I bet I'm going to be mean, but I'm a better preschooler and first grader than them because I can color in better, obviously. But they'll have so much fun doing it. Thank you so much, Anna, for thinking of them. And of course, I had to uh, keep 
the one with the with the sailboat for myself and for the travel binder. And obviously she sent me a bunch of beautiful cardstock. This one with the kitties that she used for the uh, trackers. A floral one. Yes, oh my god, these kittens. These are just perfect. And I'm so very happy that I have my own uh, for this one with the foxes and the raccoons because then you know how much I love those animals. These are pretty florals. Oh my god. And you know, this set from Kik, Anna, I'm using it. Um, this is a glossy cardstock that I'm using for my birthday savings challenge um, scratch-offs that I have on my Etsy shop. So this is the exact set, but I cannot print on uh, black and white. But I did use this one that's, uh, that's white and blue and the pink one. And this one is one of my favorites, but you cannot print anything on it. This one is the one with the pink boho. Yes, I absolutely love these ones. And these are some new patterns that I haven't seen. Oh my God, the blossoms. I can just go through these forever because I love them so, so much. Oh my God, no way. These cute pandas are everything. You spoil me. And this animal print is just gorgeous. I'm having trouble keeping everything in my hand. But these are just phenomenal and I saw some um, and I saw this pattern as a spoiler and the one with the jellyfish these are just brilliant thank you so so much for thinking of me and for sending me so many goodies I cannot wait to use all these stickers and um, and the bookmark as well it's so beautiful and so elegant so we are placing everything aside. We know these letterbox are from Anna, so let me put them here. So let's see how many I have for the week. In groceries, I still have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 80, 1, 2, 3, and 4. So I have 14 letterbox and... Um, I know, 75 that we can play with for Rox's challenge book. The pets still have 50, 60, 70, 85. They have 85 because uh, I found a great deal uh, for some kibbles. Uh, Rox actually suggested it. At first, we ordered a kit and uh, they sent out some vouchers with it and I bought two kilos, a, a big bag of food two kilos for just five ron and I bought them some uh, balls that jingle we still have the 15 coffee and spending is absolutely empty because because you know I uh, had that mishap with the with the old tripod and it was 310 lei which is 67 dollars and do you know that meme with uh, Joe Exotic Tiger King like I'm never gonna financially recover from this. Yeah, that's exactly me. So the spending money will be taken out of the budget every single week until I can recover that money or it will mean less money for savings challenges. So let me stuff the letterbox first and see if we can finish any and then I'll be right back. So I cannot believe it. We finished the C box that I started last year. Thanks to Anna. Thank you so, so much for this pile of money and the last times. And I finished the H box and the J box. 
So we can basically put them in order here uh, for the finished trackers. So we have C, G, H, and J, which is basically $100 going to different um, sinking funds, only thanks to this. And now I just got set up for Rox's savings challenge book. We have our D12 here and our D6. So let's see which challenge gets to be finished first in the binder. I'm so excited. This is why I had allocated uh, spending money in 50s because if I didn't spend it, maybe it goes to something that uh, gets finished today. I don't know. So first will be Unicorn Land. It doesn't matter. I don't need to roll to see which one I'm doing because I need to do a 30. So let me put the money in the envelope. So one, two, and three. Uh, today's video is going to be uh, recorded, I mean it is, and posted later than usual because um, it was really foggy this morning, but number six, save 100. It was really foggy this morning, but now it's back to the 80s. Um, and by 80s, I mean both the weather and the and the music that we were listening to at the radio station. So my boyfriend and I uh, went for a ride in the car and we had a lot of fun. But now that it's over, I can record my video. I can do some recycling. So that's good. So one, two, and three is a five. Four, five, six is a ten. So we're only stuffing five for the save 100. This is one disgusting bill. So five going in to save 100. Last week I had to enjoy uh, my time alone in the park because my boyfriend was uh, gone to his dad's house to help him with some yard work and to uh, cut some trees down. So uh, that's why I had to do this. Okay, Unicorn Land again. Okay, let's see. Let me put a 50 here and take out two tens. The race is on. Number four, Butterfly Garden. We only have a 10 and a five here, so let's see which one we're doing. A third, so one, two, and three, so the 10. For this one, we are adding flowers on top of the flowers that are already here from Roxas Design. So uh, let me put the pink tulip on this. Sorry, Rox, I'm covering up your name. Okay. So we have one on here. This is nerve-wracking. I don't know who will win. I know you guys are rooting for some of the challenges. Number eight, fun at the farm. So for this one, we are rolling to see uh, if we're stuffing a 10 or not. So this, the five will be a 10. And this time we need a cat. Uh, let's do this one that seems really pleased and uh, has a cute little bow. So a 10 for fun at the farm. Okay, you saw a jump. It was number 12, save 600. And we left off here, I think. So we're stuffing the 10, phew. So just two fives. I scrolled back to the last challenge. Oh my God, this envelope is so thick. Let's see number one, comfort food. We haven't done much in here. I think the last time we got popcorn guy. It doesn't matter. We're start starting from the beginning. So one, two, and three. The chocolate for 20. Okay, 20 in the first envelope. Come on, none of you wants to get done. 
Okay, fun at the farm again. As I was mentioning, Joe Exotic, now we need to add some woodland creatures here. So we've done a raccoon, fox, skunk, rabbit, hedgehog. Let's do this cute little deer here. This one d doesn't hurt anyone. And we need to roll for it. So six, six is a ten. Number four, we know what that means. Our big winner for today is Butterfly Garden, yay. So we only owe a five to this one. A five and a cute flower maybe. Let's do this magnolia looking one. And we are officially done with this. we can take out the envelope because I don't have any patience and we can condense this to uh, to make it the 100 right so none of you want anything because uh, you didn't say you wanted butterfly garden to win so let's see one two three four and five so we can grab this 50 instead. So 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. And this is the first one that's done from this binder from Rox's book. I love this one so, so much. Okay, number 10, pancakes. Now Alicia is rooting for Cookie Monster. Veronica was for pancakes. We, we will see. So we're doing the fourth one. I don't know, one, two, three, and four, so 15. You know, realistically, I'm rooting for the Summer Vibes one to be finished because it's basically kind of summer feely to me. And it's the one with the most amount so far from what Rox has wrote, uh, not the ones that uh, we're using the D6 to decide. So number one again, okay. We left off on the chocolate, so for one, two, three, and four, so 20. For the pizza guy, I love this book so, so much. I never want it to end, but sadly it will at some point. But I encourage you all to get it and to have some fun with it because it's really, really worth it. Okay, Cookie Monster. So Alicia, you got your wish and I got it too. So a 10 for the Cookie Monster. And for this one, I'm equally sad that it's over because he's so, so cute, but we still have him in an individual scratch off. So let's see if we have 130 in here. Look at these crisp bills. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1, 10, 20, 30, 130. Okay. I still have 10, 20, 30. We still have 30. <sighs> Summer vibes, you better appear right now because, uh, well, Cookie Monster isn't here. Fun at the farm again, okay. So let's see how much we owe, only a five. Let's do this cute uh, Burmanese kitty. I enjoyed my time during the P word so, so much watching uh, Tiger King on Netflix, Joe Exotic. I mean, I, I would be like him and have all those animals at the farm if it were like legal, but I know it's not. And that's why I only have stickers with cats, I guess, to use up on the challenge, but at least I have some, some possibly rabies filled animals as well. Number three, Meow. So Meow has only two left. And we are going with orange for the couch. 
that they love to scratch and everything is a 10 on this page. Okay, just one left on this one. So this can possibly finish next week if the die decides because for example today we haven't rolled any flower power. <laughs> I, I just said flower power, okay? We have 15 so we can cover any amount so it will be a 10 okay the tens I mark on these ones and let's see who gets the last five because I'm going to cheat otherwise ladybug party yay okay so thankfully for this one each of the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Each of the octagons is a five and the ladybugs are ten. We are safe. We can put a, a big blue flower blob on here. And pay this last five to the ladybug, which hasn't gotten any love in the past couple of weeks. So this was all my money guys. We managed to finish the butterfly garden and the cookie monster challenges and three letter box. Thank you so much Anna for helping me stuff them and for all of the wonderful goodies that you sent me. I hope you guys have a wonderful Sunday and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. Mm -hmm.